course, he's young, he's ambitious, he will want to end on a high. A loss here against Nakamura might well take something off what has been a great event for him. Definitely. Oh, and here we go. The games have kicked off and uh, we have a fresh defense on the board and whoa. Wow, hey, Kara Nakamura, he only needs a draw, but he's played one of the most rare uh, responses to the French defense. Look at Duda's face. Also look at the evaluation bar. The evaluation bar hates Nakamura's last move. Um, this is something we normally see when players are first learning the game, bringing the queen up to try and deliver an early checkmate, something that we call the scholar's mate. But uh, Duda will not fall for that. <laughs> um, I would fall for that. <laughs> no, 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 no. Hey, you can't, no one can fall for it in this particular position. Not right now. No. no. And, uh, okay, Duda instantly replies by pushing his pawn forward. And I think Hikaru Nakamura, maybe he wants to play in a type of bomb cloud. Hopefully, does he want to next move push the white king forward? White's Queen sortie there. Basically, definitely never ever try this, please, to any viewers, because the White Queen is going to get harassed. She's going to have to lose time. And uh, I think this is just Nakamura um, playing one of his pet lines, playing to the fans, and trying to surprise Duda. If I would kind of concoct a story of what happened, I think uh, Hikara just assumed that uh, Duda would be actually picking up his king's pawn and moving at one square further. This makes no sense whatsoever. To step back, but she could have gone here on move two. That would have been perfectly viable. Instead, Hikaru Nakamura has gone for what is quite a trendy line. Decade, which would it be? Um, 
um, any decade before the decade I was born. <laughs> so yeah. Then I would have been, well, that's what I'm saying, literally any decade any, before any 1990. Decade. Yeah. Because then I would have avoided Carlson, I would have avoided Car uh, Car <laughs> Karyakin, I would have avoided Vashi Le Graf. Oh, yeah. um, unfortunately, any tournament I played after that seemed to be, I uh, seemed to be facing these guys. And, uh, okay, I will say the 1960s. <laughs> it was quite a fun decade, lots of uh, great players around.